The IPS2 is a, is a mapping product, so it's uh, ideal for GIS, uh, for utility companies, uh, companies that are involved in the mapping processes. If you look at the IPS2 uh, today, what you have is an integration of inertial systems uh, with GPS and GLONASS system uh, for positioning, and then you have the imagery coming from a 360 degree uh, imaging system. And, and also, of course, the scanners that are the ones that provide the high accuracy measurements. And the beauty of it is that it's extremely simple to use. Just drive uh, through the street and then extract any kind of uh, information that they need from that uh, particular data set. Tremendously powerful tool to get the customer more productive. As we built this IPS2 product, what was really important for us was to keep our potential customer in mind and to have this dialogue back and forth between the user and us where we could understand the workflow of our GIS customers so that when they adopt the IPS2 system, it's really an easy transition. We are trying to make the customer more productive and that is the ultimate goal. Make it easy. Make the high tech look simple. If you need to do field calibrations, if you need to do all kind of uh, manipulations of the product, well, you are adding complexity to the product and you know, you're opening the door for more and more issues to come. So we uh, condition the, uh, the formulation of the product to this e easy, simple to use approach. Take it out of the box, put it in the truck, drive, and you're done. There's no systems that I know of that come off the shelf for mounting on a customer supplied vehicle that give you that level of integration. It provides the highly accurate positioning component, but it also provides you the whole post-processing suite to geo-reference the sensor information in 3D space. It ties this all together into an integrated package as a, really a turnkey solution that's all performed as part of the off-the-shelf system. The magic uh, touch was the integration of the imaging in a seamless fashion, and also the ability to grab existing databases and when the customer is collecting data on the picture, then uh, the database is updated also uh, seamlessly and automatically. The 3D hemispherical camera that comes with the IPS2 is a high definition camera that gives you a 3D view of your environment. So it's a picture all around. So you're able to look up and look down, look to your sides, look forward, look backwards, and you can then uh, really orient yourself within the environment. So as you're driving through, you, you get a full picture of where you are. So back in the office, what you see is a very colorful, intelligent view of the area that was mapped. It's difficult for us to really understand numbers or text information without really sitting there and thinking about it. But with a picture, our mind just knows immediately what we're looking at. The picture will not lie to us. There's not human error in the picture. So we can take that data at face value for what it's worth, use it, and have the confidence to know that it's accurate. Our software computes all of uh, the, the position and pose information, and as well as projects the sensor data to give you the 3D model. From there, you can take this accurate model information, point cloud and, and imagery, and traverse through and tag uh, assets, identify assets, take measurements within the model, and uh, export that into industry standard formats. The real beauty of it is, down the road, if additional requirements come up, I don't need to send field personnel back out into the field to collect the information. Because the IPS2 dataset is so thorough, I can just access my dataset at any time from the office and continuously extract additional information that I need for my GIS requirements. It's all right there in the data set. You will not have a point in time where there isn't a position and orientation reading for the duration of your drive. Even through tunnels, uh, under bridges, in forested areas, urban canyons, everywhere you, you have, you have a, an accurate position at that point in time. I can think back to doing GIS data collection work and actually being out on the street with handheld devices or even backpack systems and having other um, 
people on my team being out there together, which was lots of fun, but I think now how we could have used a system like this IPS2 and cut down field personnel down to one or two people and we could have done all of our work right from the office, which would have kept everybody safe and the ultimate goal of not having to do the field work at all. If you uh, started thinking about the safety issue, if you are thinking about the time that you will save by not going back to the field, then you understand really the, the power of this device. You can pay uh, the, for the whole uh, cost of the product in a few miles of road assessment. It's, it's really a, a breakthrough technology. We look at it as a, a new paradigm for how survey and GIS data is collected. Instead of taking discrete points around your environment, you're able to collect millions of points at once and then distill that, that information down and, uh, and use it for all sorts of different applications. It makes a very complex uh, system of different technologies simple to use, all together, integrated and really, really uh, productive. And that's, uh, that's, that's what makes us so excited about this product. In the future, this product, as it keeps evolving, it will create uh, a, really a revolution of the way that uh, surveying and mapping is done. This is really the future of the surveying and mapping industry.